seven adopt me hacks and glitches we're gonna be checking out how we can always hatch a legendary some of the secret locations in the game and some glitches that were definitely not intended to be introduced but first leave this video a thumbs up and comment down below if you'd like a free ride potion let's start off with hack number one this is going to be a secret location which some of you guys might not even know about but some of you guys you might know this so what we want to go and do is start walking over to the tunnel to the no so we're going to start off with some classic adult me glitches and slowly make our way to the best ones that some of you guys will have absolutely no idea of. So you know you can normally just like walk through the tunnel and obviously it will take you to the neighborhood. That's not what we want, we want something better. So if you actually walk up to this right hand side and walk against the wall just like this, like slowly walk against it just like this. It lets you get through, okay? I kid you not. Like, now we're in an area you couldn't normally have gone and got. This normally would have taken us to the neighborhood. But now we've gone and snuck through. And guess what? You can do it again. And again. And again. And you can keep sneaking out. So now we're, like, in a fake neighborhood. Now if you have, like, a fly or a ride pet, you can kind of just, like, go under the map. This is, like, one of the strangest glitches. You can explore Adopt Me from the underneath. In case you've ever wondered, what does the underside of Adopt Me look like? Well, it's a bit of a mess. Yes, we can all agree on that. But hey, this is what Adopt Me looks like. It's a very strange glitch. Like, look at this. This is the ice skating rink from underneath. It's so weird to see, but at the same time, it's pretty awesome. We can even go for a swim in this weird, mysterious area, which I believe is where the mini games are. Number two, getting a secret area in Adopt Me. To do this glitch, we're gonna go and grab ourselves a small chair. By going and doing so, it will allow us to go and place it. And this only works on like certain walls, by the way. You'll then press E to sit on the chair, and if you do this successfully, you should be able to go and now like zoom out. And what you then do is place another chair, which you can then sit on, and boom. You can now um, just like make your own private area. So what I've done is I've made like a whole other section to my house on the outside of it. That's right, you can literally go and like extend it. This is just like already built into the house. So I didn't actually add any of this flooring and stuff. You can see I can't edit any of this because this is like built in. So it's given me a massive platform, this awesome water area, which is pretty nice in case you want like some little fish decorations or something. You can make some little fish or an aquarium. But then we have this area, which I go and use for some mini games where, you know, the first person type the word cookie gets a free legendary or a ride potion um so this is that's how you go and get to secret locations this only does work on certain walls however so just keep experimenting and spamming this chair in random places in your house in hope that it will work in that spot. Today's video is sponsored by G-Round is a global gaming community platform discovering unreleased outstanding games in all gaming genres. And new games are updated every single Thursday. You can play two free games every single week, leave reviews and also speak to the developers of the video game. You can earn G points by writing reviews and giving feedback to game developers. You can use G-Points to buy some amazing gear from the G-Points store. Be sure to download the app and help game developers through G-Round. The link's down below in the description. The next glitch is called Mind Control. So what that does is basically control someone. So to do so, you need yourself a lovely grappling hook. And what this does is it literally lets you push people around. So this random unexpecting person, we're gonna stand right behind them and then use the grappling hook and try and drag them over to here. And as you can see, we forcefully, like forcefully, we literally forced this person to come on over and move, which is slightly entertaining. Um, this guy probably didn't want me to push him all the way over here. We can just keep pushing the guy if he stays still. I wonder how far we can like actually pull the dude. Um, it's quite funny glitch. Obviously, this does get annoying. I've like filmed tons of videos and people just like yeet me around by doing this. It does get annoying, so I wanted to demonstrate how annoying this could get um, by going and doing it. You literally just like stand here right in front of their face and then grapple them 
and it pushes them around. So it doesn't always work because obviously guys, it's a glitch, but as long as like the grapple goes through them, um, then it generally works. So let's go and get this person and push them. It's quite a strange glitch. Let me know if you know about that one. Okay, now guys, we're gonna go and experiment with some of the strangest glitches possible, incorporating strange vehicles, which you can't actually go and get anymore. This next glitch is going to make you fly as high as possible into the sky, which is a pretty funny looking glitch. To do so, you need to have yourself a hoverboard, which might not be too easily accessible for those people who don't have a legendary hoverboard, as this, I guess, hasn't been in the game for a while. What you want to go and do is then go and get yourself a lazy float, which is useful as these things are only common. You then want to go and stand, get your lazy float and just click it, okay? And look, it just yeets you into the sky and um, sometimes it will drop down and just keep yeeting you up. And uh, eventually you will fly into the sky as high as possible. You're basically gonna become a planet. We're, we're going to space, ladies and gentlemen. It's, it's a really fun glitch. It just makes you go really high as possible. And it definitely confuses a lot of people. It is very strange. Look, and now I can just jump off. And uh, we're going to fall to our doom and probably bounce everywhere. Which is the perfect time for you guys to go and leave this video a like. And subscribe. Whoa, I actually landed on the pool floaty. Are you kidding me? That's like some next level trick shot stuff. I, I don't think I could do that if I even tried to have gone and done that. Up next, we're gonna go and get ourselves the world's biggest balloon. So let's go and do so. We're gonna go and get ourselves a dragon balloon. The next hack that we're gonna go and do is make the world's biggest adult me balloon. To go and do so, get yourself your favorite balloon of choice. I think this one works really well with the dragon balloon. So you then need to go and press dress up while the dragon balloon is equipped. Go and scroll down to this section where it allows you to select all of these pre-made Roblox outfits. We're then going to go and select something such as this weird fire demon thing. And straight away you can notice that my balloon has already gained length. You'll then click onto this and then click back onto this. And by repeatedly changing on and off, you'll notice that this is slowly getting larger and larger and larger, and you can do this like a hundred times. The more you do it, the bigger the glitch gets. And to be honest, I'm surprised Adopt Me has not fixed this glitch yet. It's been in the game for a long time, and it definitely looks like someone is hacking, or something has gone severely wrong. So we're gonna go and do all of this, and then change back to my normal avatar, and now we have the world's biggest balloon in a dummy. Like, this thing is so long that you can't even see the end of it. And it also extends out downwards. It's very strange. It's just like these giant blue lines. It looks like a giant laser is going out of the top and the bottom. This is what seems to be the dragon's back feet, which is somehow glitching out. I'm not really sure how this works at all, but it does and it is one of the strangest glitches. Is it useful? No, but can you prank your friends and confuse them? Definitely. We're gonna see some people's reaction. This person said that they really like the balloon. It definitely does confuse some people, and I'm sure not many people actually know about this Adopt Me hack, mainly because uh, it, it serves no purpose, so not many people go and do it, but hey, go and do so if you wish. I'm pretty sure none of these like glitches or hacks are going to like affect your Adopt Me account, but it is a glitch at the end of the day, and it's not doing any harm, I guess, so Adopt Me, please don't get us in trouble for sharing that. I mean, maybe it's a deliberate thing that they put into the game, because why else would this feature even be a thing? Which moves us on to the next section, which is one of the strangest things possible. What we want to go and do is search ice, or just try and find, I think it's called a queen. Yeah, so search queen, okay? And this, this is where it gets exciting. So we're now dressed up as this lovely, adorable queen outfit, right? That looks cool. Everything looks normal. Well, not till you go and press actions and press sit down. Where you then become some type of weird queen hovercraft 
where it travels you around the map literally at the fastest speed possible. I kid you not. This is the fastest speed you can actually travel around the map. It just keeps getting faster and faster as long as you don't crash into anything. So you could just go and do laps. Who needs a vehicle when you can go and zoom around the map as a queen? Like, look at this. Look how crazy that is. Um, we're going to change perspective so you guys know that this isn't like a scam. But if you change into first perspective, you can then control it a lot easier. Um, you can literally just like face which way you want to go and you'll zoom. Like this isn't a scam. You guys have to try this one out for yourself. It is definitely like the strangest glitch possible. Lastly, we're going to go and test out a hack where supposedly it will let us go and get any pet that we want. So how this works is we go and buy the egg, which has the pet inside that we are after. So as I'm going to try and hatch a phoenix, I have purchased a mythical egg. You then want to scroll down- wait, I'm missing a pet- oh, okay, the St. Bernard, of course. I was gonna say, I have every pet possible. So apparently what you then need to do is like select the pet you want. Bro, I've got no idea if this works, so we type slash Theo Nix. Let me type it in the chat. Is that is that how you spell it? I I I don't know how if that's how you spell it. Oh no, I spelled it wrong. Okay, slash P H O it, Bro, my spelling so bad. E N I X. Okay, like this. Let me press hatch now and say goodbye to my Robux. Bye bye Robux. Please be a Phoenix. Please tell me I haven't wasted my Robux onto this. Oh, that's painful. The pain, the suffering, all of that for a Sasquatch. Okay, Mr. Robux, don't fail me now. Will we go and get it by clicking it five times? Bro, these TikTok hacks have lost the plot. One, two, three, four, five. Please be a legendary. Come on, let's go. Okay, I've got my eyes closed. Did we get one? Let me know in the comments. Did we get it? Okay, I'm going to open them in three. Two, one, what did I get? A Kirin? Bro, this is the biggest scam. I have, I have Evan, I just spent so much money on this. I just spent all my Robux and we didn't get one. Okay, we'll try one more time. One, two, three, four, five. Bro, I'm not sure this is gonna work. I'm not sure it's gonna work, but we're gonna try it anyway. Can we go and hatch ourselves a legendary from this? Please. Please, another Karen. Okay, I'm gonna just click it and then just do it, okay? Guys, wish me luck. All my Robux is gone down the drain, ladies and gentlemen. Will we go and hatch the legendary... Bro, I, I have literally just hatched like four Karens in a row. How is that physically possible? G guys, you can't guarantee it, okay? There is no way you can guarantee that you're gonna hatch a legendary. I, I guess, okay, will this work? Did we get it? Nope, we got the wolf patinka. Okay, well, moral of the story is that uh, TikTok hacks don't work, but hey, at least we have seven working hacks that do work, um, which, you know what? I'll take that as a win. Seven. Seven's not too bad. Oh, no. Oh, wait, you know what this is? This. This is the infinite egg glitch. Where it just poops eggs out. <laughs> okay, guys. Well, if you somehow have never come across this glitch, it literally poops eggs. These glitches have broken, adult me. Look at all of these eggs. Oh my goodness.